There's an overweight man and an overweight woman on the sofa watching TV. He's yelling his opinion at the television. She looks up from her food and agrees. They got two bumper stickers on the pickup truck to keep the pickup parked outside. One bumper sticker says, what would Jesus do? The other bumper sticker says, the power of pride. Now, I was thumbing through the stations on my own television when I came upon a guy on this religious station, and he was singing Somebody's Coming, and he sounded even whiter than me somehow. Wow. Well, that took me back in time through dwindling joy back to when I was such a guilt-ridden Catholic boy. I'm evangelical agnostic now. And how? And Christians, hey, don't walk out on me just yet. You know whose name I'll be yelling as I'm clutching my chest. The one my dad told me to and his told him to. And hell, I probably pray as much or more than you do and believe shit every word I sang. But believing and knowing, those are two different things. And when it comes to saying how a stranger's life's got to go, well, that's where I believe I'm going to stick with what I know. Which is nothing, you know, nothing for sure. So just chill till the next episode. Now, back to the lecture at hand. It seems my neighbor wants to kill what he don't understand. And I say, we just can't kill what we don't understand. And then I turn on my TV and I see, oh, yeah, well, we can. We can and we have since the dawn of man for countless gods. His only real seeming plan was to see to it the clean of the life was our fate. And you got to admit, life's pretty great. But can you deny that it's killing us? Thank you. I'll be here all week. You know, if life is anything, it's uncertain. A rusty nail through a careless shoe. And if you're not the dumb kid out running around, well, you just got to do what you were born to do. So, hey, happy new year, everybody. Happy birthday, country Joe. I resolve to do what I always do. I ain't hurting you. <laughs>